What's up, y'all? Back with some more free game. Please make sure y'all do like, subscribe, and comment below. And I hope y'all can watch all the way to the end. I do appre appreciate the love and the support if you have made it to the third part of this three-part series. Let's get right to it. All right. So the first two, I talked about how to take girls on dates, getting to know them. You feel me? Putting that charm, that seduction. You feel me? Fucking them good, giving them sex, good sex, maintaining their attraction. So now you got these girls, you feel me? The, the main reason I want y'all to maintain their attraction, seduce them, you feel me? Y'all, you want them to submit to you, be feminine with you, cook for you, you want to fuck them good, you feel me? You want to put that seduction on them, put your mouthpiece on them, mainly because with life, everything in life is temporary, you feel me? Ain't none of this shit gonna last forever. I won't be here all the time, you feel me? It's gonna be a point in time where my kids watch, my kids, kids, kids watch me on YouTube and I'm not around anymore, you feel me? So, these bitches is not gonna stay in y'all rotation forever, man. Once they, once they just see and once they peep game that, hey, he really not looking for nothing serious. What am I doing here? You feel me? I'm. He just gonna keep leading me on. It was fun while it lasted. You feel me? She was here for. A, he was here for a good time, not a long time. So once they see they being led on, they really gonna meet your standards. So you're not gonna really uh, commit to them. You feel me? That because that's the reason why. If, if they haven't met your standards, you, you would keep dating them, but you really don't want to commit to them. So they're not gonna stay in your rotation forever. You feel me? They, you might be able to keep them for a while. What I'm teaching y'all is how to keep them in your rotation for as long as you can. You feel me? Because we we don't give a fuck. We we not really trying to get attached to the bitch. We just want them to stay in our rotation as long as we can. We not thinking about. Uh, uh, excuse me. We're not thinking about losing a quality woman or you feel me? So with this, since they spot is not solidified, you feel me? Since they not going to hold you down and be solid and just st stick around, even though you're not going to commit to them, you want to be constantly bringing in new girls. It don't stop. You can't never get comfortable. You feel me? A lot of, like I said, a lot of y'all came in attraction to one girl, let alone four or five. You feel me? So y'all got to, you got to really be a red pill alpha man. You can't, you got to really want polygamy. This got to be the lifestyle, you feel me? Because if not, then you don't get just, you don't get tired of it. You gonna because dealing with more, a lot of, a lot of females, you feel me? They just, they, they hormones, estrogen, just the different stress they bring. It's not for everybody, you feel me? It's, it's for me though. It's, it's for all y'all who read people watching this, all y'all who want polygamy. So just having this, man, y'all got to keep, y'all got to constantly bring in new bitches, you feel me? You can't stop dating new girls. You can't stop texting new girls. <clears throat> Just because you got four or five girls, that don't mean that you stop dating and looking for new bitches to bring it to your rotation. <clears throat> that just means you maintain their attraction and try and keep them there as long as you can while you prepping new girls to, to replace them. You feel me? Once they want to go meet new dudes, they getting tired of getting let on. They want something solid. They want a commitment. They want kids. They want to start a family. You feel me? Because I'm not trying to teach y'all how to start a family over here. I could if y'all want that advice, but I'm not... This is not the goal. You feel me? So you bringing in new girls. You still going out dating, partying, clubbing. You feel me? And the, the good thing this does do for you, you having a three, four, five girl rotation. When you do go out, if you don't get a girl number, you feel me? You don't give a fuck. It's like you still got your peace of mind. So you never going out in a thirsty state because you already got bitches you dealing with. A girl don't want to give you her number. Hey, I got... I already got three girls I can call for a booty call if, if need be. You feel me? For a sneaky link. She can bring her spend the night back. I, I, I can care less if she... You feel me? So, but y'all still want to continue to date, prospect, meet new girls. Girls ain't real flaky. They interests go up and down on the regular. You feel me? That Today they might be in love with you. They might be on your team. You feel me? They, they on your dick heavy. Tomorrow she meet a dude who got a little bit more popularity. Look a little better. She on his team now. You feel me? So you got to constantly, you got to beat them at their own game. Girls got options. So we got to keep our options, I don't know, keep our options open too. You feel me? It's just, just like the NBA. LeBron, he not going to be playing for years and years. He not going to stay in his prime until his 40s and 50s. So the Lakers, they, they constantly, that's what the, this is what the drive is for. Just because a, a motherfucker is a legend, they not going to last. They skills, they talent is not going to be on that elite level forever. So they got to constantly bring in new new talent, 
new players from college. You feel me? This this is gonna keep them at a at a off at a uh, playoff level team. You feel me? this is gonna keep them going to the finals every year. So you gotta have that same mentality, man. Constantly bring in new females. Constantly date new girls. You feel me? You constantly um, texting, calling new girls. You feel me? It's gonna develop your game too. The more the more women you talk to, the better your game get. The better you can seduce. You feel me? The more you can pick up on their different tendencies. You feel me? So, I just need y'all to know that, man. It's constantly bringing in new bitches. You can't never get comfortable with your girls you got, but you do want to maintain the attraction as long as you can. Feed them bitches a fantasy. We don't give. We, we lead the bitches on over here. They, they they do the same thing to us, so we gonna keep them in our rotation for as long as we can. Hey, baby, open to a relationship. Uh, I just like taking my time. You feel me? It could go somewhere in the back of my head. Huh? <laughs> Stupid bitch. Oh, this is not going to be no fucking commitment. You feel me? So with this, man, keep me in rotation as long as you can. Now, the next thing y'all need to know is we humans. We got emotions, too. We just don't got as much emotions as women because we don't have as, as much estrogen as they do. You feel me? So we not we not not we not naturally emotional, but we still do have our emotions. So, a girl, your girl's in rotation, you can fall for one of them. You feel me? You can get attached, fall in love. If you don't do this one thing, this this is what I need y'all to do, man. Don't see your girl's in rotation on more than one or two days a week. You feel me? You don't want to give her that much that that much certainty. Bitch, you got Monday and, and Saturday. Them your days. It might switch up from time, but you want to give your girls a limited amount of time. You can't you can't catch feelings for a girl if you only seeing her one or two days out of the week. You feel me? And you seeing with other bitches, so you constantly your mind is constantly on other things than her. You on your shit. I I, I told y'all in the self improvement video, man. Y'all want to go to school for a trade, skill, degree. You feel me? You got a social life of abundance. You got your hobbies. So you only seeing her one or two days a week, man. It's gonna limit how much you can become attached to him. You you can like her. You can like her a lot. As long as you don't catch feelings, fall in love, you feel me? This is, I'm, this is what I'm trying to help you all to avoid. Just try new shit, man. Just go out, join a bowling league, man. Start, because like this painting behind me, I, I, I painted that shit. You feel me? I just learned how to paint. It's been about two years. I don't know if I can paint as good, but just try new shit, man. Try hobbies, anything to occupy your time and, and keep your mind off of her when you're not with her. And you won't catch feelings. You're not going to get attached, but she will. You feel me? Because if you're doing everything right, she's going to become obsessed. You feel me? She's going to fall in love with you. So, with her falling in love with you, you're doing everything right. You're giving her experience when you're with her. You're taking her on nice dates. She's fucking her good. You feel me? Because if, if you can control her mind, you control her body. You feel me? So, if you can mind fuck this bitch, if you can get her emotions, her feelings, if you can get her engaged in her feelings and her emotions, she going to stay. she going to stay for a while. You feel me? She gonna be there in the long run because it's hard to leave. You are drugged now. You get that dopamine rush in her in her brain. You feel me? You 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 the one she think about when she at work. I want I wonder what I wonder what Evan doing. Is he is he thinking about me? You feel me? So from here, so you feel me? She since girls emotional, you doing everything right. You seducing her, putting that mouthpiece on her. You feel me? You not seeing her as much. It's just you doing everything right. She she might become obsessed with you. So she's gonna wanna know if she's this obsessed with you, she like you this much. She wanna know that all those feelings, that love, you feel me? Her emotions. She wanna know if all this is being reciprocated back to her. Do you like her do you like me as much as I like you? This is gonna be what what the fuck is gonna pop in her head. You feel me? So from here, no validation. Don't don't express to her how you feel about her. Even if she asking you, you feel me? She she texts you, hey, you know I love you, right? You not going to, hey, I, I love you too, you feel me? I, I, I'm i glad, you feel me? I'm glad I can meet you. Mm -mm. We not giving her no validation. We going to keep keep her guessing. Don't ever expose your deck. You feel me? You you you, you, you plan to your, to your advantage because you got her mind going now. So now you want to, you feel me? You want to make her chase your validation. She tell you she love you. You're not going to tell her you love her back, even if you do. Keep that shit. Keep your feelings smothered. You feel me? You want to tell her, I'm glad I can be that special man in your life, baby. You feel me? 
It's she gonna be flattered, but she gonna wanna she gonna want that validation back. That's not enough for her. You feel me? She gonna keep she gonna keep chasing that validation. Do do he love me? Is he really? Is he is, is is this even worth it? Should I just keep chasing this guy? I don't even know how he feel about me. You want her? You want her chasing that? You feel me? Chasing that feeling, chasing that certainty that you feel me. So even if she, so, say if you tell her, yeah, I'm glad I can be that special man in your life, baby, in a seductive tone, you know. Yeah, I'm glad I can be that special man in your life, you know. Seductive. Yeah, baby, I'm glad I can be that special man in your life. You feel me? So, say if she. So do you love me? You are you already know the answer to that, baby. You feel me? You know how I feel about you. Did you you don't want to give her that certainty. The moment a girl get gets comfortable, the moment she knows where she stands with you, you feel me? The, the, the moment that you validate her feelings, that you like her as much as she like you, is the moment she's gonna get comfortable. She's gonna be a little less feminine. She got a little bit of breathing room now. She got leg room. You feel me? She don't gotta chase your validation. She know how she she know how you feel about her. You feel me? Now she gonna she gonna try and take your attention from from your other bitches, from your social life. You feel me? She she trying to get you wrapped around her fucking finger right now. We not going for that. No validation. She sent even I don't give a fuck. She sent you a nude. You feel me? She her 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 legs wide spread open. You feel me? I just wanna bless you. Have a good day, daddy. You feel me? You don't want to give her no validation. Appreciate the pick. Have a nice day too. You feel me? You don't want to. You don't want to give her the luxury of feeling good, giving her that validation. You feel me? You don't want her to be satisfied, be comfortable with you. You want her to be uneasy with with, with, with her mental. She asks you. She posts a picture on Facebook. I done had a girl. I, I'm gonna tell you all a brief story, man. I was I was laying up with this girl one day, and it was like. She had took a picture, and it it was cute. I ain't gonna lie to you. She looked bad, like a bad bitch. You feel me? And we we on Facebook. She kept scrolling past it. She wanted me to say something about it. And then finally, you feel me? We was on Facebook. I, I think we was watching like some 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 sort of videos, whatever the fuck. I think it was like some parody shit, whatever it was. And then she finally scrolled back up to it. Like, don't you think I look nice? You feel me? I was like, yeah, you got a lot of likes. You feel me? It's, yeah, those some good angles. I fuck with it. It's different. You feel me? You don't nobody. You don't want to tell her to look nice. You don't want to get all googly eyed and shit like yeah, baby, that's beautiful. You feel me? Don't heart it. Don't act like you ain't even see the shit. Yo, you take one of your girls on a date, and she looking better than she usually do. She trying to get cute for you. She got on her little sexy sundress, all red hair, hair, hair done nice. You feel me? Lashes in. You feel me? She got her nails and shit done. Don't don't even mention it. Don't give her the, don't give her the satisfaction of letting her know that she looked good that day. What this is gonna do is gonna keep her uneasy and it's gonna keep her chasing your validation. It's too many times in relationships, y'all y'all compliment y'all girls too much. You validating the girls, feeding her ego. You feel me? It's gonna make her. It's gonna make it's gonna make her feel herself a little too much. You feel me? She she gonna know she she got you wrapped around her finger. She knows she got you where you want her. Where she wants you, you feel me? She know that you it. So keep her guessing, man. Don't never expose your feelings. Just make make her have to wonder. You feel me? The more she wonders, the more she chasing that shit. The more feminine submissive, you, you feel me? She gonna fuck. She gonna fuck you good, cause she want that validation from you. She wanna know that. She wanna know that her emotional brain just can't take a guy not want to compliment her. And I want to tell him, tell her how she, how you feel about her. You feel me? Her emotional brain can't take that. So what y'all gonna know is she gonna chase your validation. Never give it to her, man. She send you a picture. Hey, babe, how how, how this look? Uh, yeah, it's, it's cool. I fuck with it. You feel me? What you mean it's cool? You fuck with it? Like, how do I look? It's decent. You don't want to give her that validation, man. So. That's that's the final thing y'all need to know, man. So I hope y'all enjoyed the video, man. We're dealing with y'all rotations, maintaining her attraction. If y'all do everything right, if y'all do everything I just told y'all to a T, it will last. Now, I said no validation. Let me touch on this. I don't mean no validation at all. You feel me? I, like I said in the prior video, you don't want to take anything to a to. You don't want to take anything to 
too high or too low. You feel me? I would say just keep it at a minim minimum. Every so often, you drop a compliment on her. A lot of dating coaches, they say no compliment, no compliments at all. I just say keep it at a, at a, at a minimum. So low to where it's like you damn near not really giving her no compliments. You feel me? She asks you how you, how she look every so often. Yeah, you look nice. You feel me? You pretty. It's going to mean a lot because you never really give it to her. Now, she could go and get compliments from other guys. When we red pill, we offers, we, we don't give a fuck. You feel me? We, 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 we want her to get compliments from other guys. They compliments ain't going to mean shit because they not her drug. We is. You feel me? Your compliments is going to mean a lot. You tell her how she how she look. You tell her how you feel about her. You feel me? Like you just text her out the blue one day, baby. I really do appreciate you. You feel me? You 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 bring joy to my life. This this gonna be something I say maybe once every six months, and I never I probably keep keep that gap six six months to a year. You feel me? So if you enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed this three part series, if you learned anything, man, spread the love. Um, comment below. Hope y'all watch all the way to the end. If you did, I do appreciate you. See y'all later.